Hello guys, this is Rodri and I'm here to answer you the, the questions you give to me, so let's go. Okay, the first question, how are you staying fit? Okay, I try to do every day like one hour exercises. Uh, uh, fortunately, uh, I'm in Madrid here we, in, my, in my parents' home and it has a, a big garden so I can, I can run not too much, but I can move my my body to stay fit, so uh, just trying to do some exercise in, inside the house and outside a bit of running. How do you keep in contact with your teammates and what is being talked about right now? <laughs> okay, well, with my teammates I, I normally text in the, in the group message we have in the team. And what are we talking about? Like, we, we, we don't know what's going on, you know, it's weird for everyone else. And, um, we don't know eventually when we're coming back, but that's the most thing we, we talk about, uh, the fact when are we coming back. If you could be one of your teammates for a day, who would it be and why? This is a difficult, very difficult question, but I uh, would be a teammate that live in a, in a very good country with good views. I would be one of the Brazilian guys, I think so. Where are your football medals right now? Well, I have a uh, half in here, uh, the one I conceived before City and the one with City. In, I had it in Manchester, so I, I can show you guys. So, but in another video, I could I could show you. What's the last song you listened to? I think the last song I listened to uh, is uh, I Don't Care uh, by Ed Sheeran and Justin Bieber. I, I like that song. What can you cook better than anyone else? This is so easy for me. It would be fajitas. Uh, my fajitas are top level, so uh, I recommend you to come to my house. Not everyone, huh? <laughs> Which three people in the history would you invite to your house for dinner? This, this would be very difficult. I would say uh, one for sure would be Freddie Mercury. The other one would be Michael Jordan. And the last one, let me check. I don't know. I would say Royal Federer. What song gets you on the dance floor? There are many that make me because I, I like dancing, but um, I would say um, one of reggaeton, maybe uh, one of the Daddy Yankee, La Gasolina, for example. What is your most offending memory from childhood? I would say playing football. Uh, it was one of the, my greatest. Uh, times uh, when I played uh, small in the small court, uh, it was called uh, seven football, and uh, the, those remembers for me are the are the best ones. So when I always remember my childhood, I always remember with the ball, of course, and playing uh, with my with my teams. What would you say to the five-year-old you? Uh, I would say to enjoy to enjoy life enjoy what you do, uh, uh, your hobby, football, uh, you know, to enjoy your uh, family uh, because uh, when you're a kid you don't understand this thing but it's the most important thing about life so uh, I have done, done it and I'm, I'm really happy for that and I would say that to, to me when I was five. Outside of football, what are you passionate about? Well, my passion is always related with, with sports, so it would not be football, it would be basketball or tennis or other kind of sports, so for me it would be uh, the sport in general. And the last one, if you could teach one school subject that isn't physical, what would you be and why? I think I would teach physics because uh, I enjoy experimenting and I enjoy uh, the problems that are not boring and as in other languages. So I would think physics. So uh, maybe you will see me as a physics uh, teacher. 
but uh, of course uh, it's, it was important for me learning and, and uh, this is one of my favorite subjects. So guys, thank you very much and this is my answer. Uh, hope you are staying well at home and safe and see you soon. Bye.